All right, hello everybody. Welcome back to another First Impressions review. This time it is a game called Echo an Indie Tell. There are a lot of games called Echo on Steam, but this one came out about a month ago by Richard Borgay, I guess. Uh, and uh, this developer has a few titles on Steam. Well, Bri Brian the Brain and Brian the Brain Special Edition. So really only one other game. Uh, before this, a 99 cent title, and that was about five or six months before this one. So, welcome to the Steam Indie Gaming Program, Mr. Richard Borgay. I guess that's how you say his name. I'm just hoping. Uh, you are fragile, and the world is dangerous. Explore with care and courage, solve puzzles, overcome obstacles in search of something an outlet, an answer, a hope. Now, only has one user review. It is positive. This game comes in at a $2.99 price tag. And we're going to find out if this game's worth the three bucks, guys. We'll be back to play Echo and in detail. Be back to do that right after this. All right, welcome back, everybody. I did just launch the game. It launched in a window here, and I tried to capture with game capture on OBS if that means anything to you guys, but it wasn't working. So we're going to go ahead and look at the options here, and the volume seems pretty loud. We're going to go ahead and choose English here on the sound, and there are no other options to, like, make full screen window. Okay. Yeah, we can't do that either. And we can't drag it, right? Nope, not a game maker game. Or they did, if it is a game maker game, there's no option to drag the window and increase the size. All right, so we'll just go ahead and play here. I'll probably go ahead and zoom in in my video editor so you guys can see. So Echo and Intel version 1.01. The music. And we are a floating feather, it looks like. Let's go ahead and turn the volume down just a little bit on OBS. Because I know I turned my music down on my headset, since there is no option to do the music in the game. I could adjust the volume. Okay, so we're a feather, we landed on an oil slick, and now. Now we're here floating, and I move around with... Oh, I'm a balloon! Okay, I saw the tail. Okay. So I'm a feather inside of a balloon. So I'm guessing I can't hit any sharp rocks or anything like that, or it'll probably kill my balloon, and I'm guessing I'll die. Just a guess. Just using me. Oh, what the hell? Whoa. Okay, left mouse button, right mouse button, do nothing. You know? All right, what the hell is all this? Looks like a, a mirror? Oh no, this is probably me. Okay, so basically I think it's saying to get this and then I can push a button or something. Um. Oh God, okay. Okay, so now I get that thing and I have maggots all crawling around me. Okay, so maggots are crawling around in the balloon, I guess. That's what it looks like. I don't know why they look like maggots, because they're kind of creepy, and they're crawling around, and they look like maggots. Okay. Do I do something here? No. Space bar, nothing. Space bar over here. Okay, so you push the space bar once it lights up, and it opens the door. Yeah, you know that if I hit any of these jagged edges, probably anywhere, it'll probably kill me. All right. So we're only floating because... So we are the feather, and the only reason we're floating is because we have a helium balloon, I guess. Yeah, so we're not going through here, right? No. We gotta get a key or whatever. Right. This is a little bit... A little bit tight here. 
Yeah, at least there's not a timer or anything like that. There's no timer counting down, pressuring you to do it as quickly as possible. And there's not even like a a timer like for you know the highest score or whatever. Oh my god, I almost hit the rock there. The maggots again. Now it's a weird indicator that you got the key to have what looks like maggots floating around your balloon. Okay. Yeah, I think I would have picked something different. Like, I, I, if it was me, I probably would have just changed the black balloon to, like, green or something. Rather than making this look. But hey, it works, right? Yeah, I don't know why I think that looks like maggots. But you guys can tell me what it looks like. Yep, and then we hit space. And the maggots open the door. Okay. Yikes. Okay. See what's up there if we come up here. Okay, so we got to get through there, and it looks like we're going up somewhere. Before we can do that, let's go down here and... Because I have a feeling we need to get the key again, or whatever. The maggots. I'm going to call them. Where are the maggots at? There's my maggots. Okay, let's go... Yeah, I think we need to go around this way. Oh, there's another door. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. No, no, no. Leave me alone, leave me alone. Phew. That was a little bit stressful. Okay, I... Whoa! I'm guessing I can't open that door yet. That's just a guess. I'm guessing I have to come up here, but I don't know. There's something this way, so we're gonna go with my gaming hunch here, and, and we're gonna wait right here. Oh. Okay. I think we can make both. We can. Nice. Alright. Not being too cautious, but I'm hoping that if I die, I don't have to start all the fuck over again. All right. You just gotta be really careful in this game. Don't rush it. There's nothing. I mean, these puzzles so far are pretty simple. Okay, so it's saying to use the maggots to. Oh, this is what we need to open the door. We need the flower to open the door. Yeah, because we see we don't have the maggots on us right now. Uh. Okay, so I hit space, and then I sucked it up. Now I got the maggots. Now I can open the door. So you need the maggots to open the doors. Okay. And I, I'm sure these aren't really maggots, but spark, it's a sparkle or something, probably. Like I said, I would have, if it would have been me, I wouldn't have had any sparkle or anything at all. I would have just changed the black balloon to, like, green, or a dark shade of green or something. So that you had access to the door. I think that would have been a better art decision, but I'm not going to go for it here. I'm going to get greedy because I don't want to die and start all the way over here. But just to be funny, I'm going to call it the maggots. I want you guys to, anybody that watches this, let me know if they agree with me that it kind of looks like maggots floating around my balloon. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Ah! No! No! Oh my god. No, I have to do this. Well, at least I didn't start all the way over again. That's so close, too. Okay. So we're gonna... Now we're gonna go. And there's no, like... There's no shift button to move faster or anything. Just WASD. Oh, God. Oh, God. I like this. Okay, so now we get the thing that helps suck up the maggots. We get the maggot juice. Yeah. Alright. Let's be more careful this time. We can do both, we know that. Okay. This is really just hand-eye coordination, but there is a little bit of float to your balloon. You kind of got to get used to it. Alright. So now we can suck up the maggots here. Base. Go. Maggots. Maggots open the door. Alright, let's just not get in too big of a hurry, because I don't want to be here all day. Alright. Kind of fun. I mean, this is a very... Um, I would say non-stressful game, but very casual game. It is a little bit stressful, though. Like, when the blades get close to you, like, right before I died last time, I was, like, kind of clenching my ass cheeks just a little bit. Just saying. Alright. 
So to the developer, I would definitely add like music rather than just hearing the mechanics of all the, the spinning blades and the doors and stuff like that. I feel like a really soft ambient kind of music would go really nice for this game. Something to kind of help with the stress levels, you know what I mean? Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Ooh, that was close. Alright. So I'm guessing it saves at every door. Oh, and now we go into the light. Go into the light, young lad. Alright, so now we have a four. We have a four. Okay, so... We have... A puzzle. Um... So, this one matches that one there, so I'm guessing that's the fourth one, fourth button we hit. These looks like buttons. Um... I'm going to guess we want the arrow to go here, so we're going to choose the second one here? Just a guess. I have no idea. I guess it'll kill me if I get it wrong. Okay. Okay. So now we want this one, I'm guessing. See if I'm right. There we go. Yep. And then you just choose whichever one's next. Not very hard. All right. And then we already got that clue right there. I mean, it's the only other button, too. Boink. We the man. Now I need my maggots. Where are my maggots at? Probably up here. Oh god. Um. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, wow. Whoa. Now I got a baby... A baby bird or something in a basket. This is way too much stress. Man. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Ah! Whew. I think I got lucky there. I got lucky that it loaded the next level. Alright, what the hell is this? What? I have no idea what that means. Or what this means. I'm guessing we can't touch the balloon or the, the basket do anything or we're dead. Alright. It sounds like a washing machine, not a fan. Or a blade spinning. I think this guy recorded his fucking washing machine. To put it in the game. Just saying. I was like... What the fuck does this mean? Yeah, I have no idea what these symbols mean. I'm just moving, guys. Alright. Alright. This is gonna be harder here because we have... We're a lot bigger, basically. We're gonna go right after. We're gonna... Oh god, no, 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 oh, 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 shit. See what I mean about clenching my ass cheeks? Yeah. Oh god, this is way too fucking... Oh, this developer's crazy. Oh my god. Ah, uh, fuck! That is a little bit too tough. The developer's... This is one of those games where the developer watches these videos. Like, I feel like the developer, more than wanting to make any kind of money on this game he makes this game and then he goes and watches people like me play this and die in these tight spots like that and he just fucking kicks back and drinks a beer just laughing his ass off probably eating popcorn like the value of watching people fail miserably like i just did at his game is probably just satisfying as fuck to this guy probably worth more than the money he's making i'm just saying all right so, god oh, damn, okay, 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 no, no, mommy, no, no, there's a little bit of lag here, and I don't know if it's because I'm recording the gameplay or what, but I'm noticing some, like, laggy spots, and I don't know why, I, I don't think it's my computer, my computer should definitely be able to handle a game that looks like this, oh my god, so see, I gotta go down a little bit here, this is so fucking stressful here. I'm trying to tap, like, S just a little bit. God damn it. This is so stressful. Oh my god. No, 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 no. Oh my god. And then... Ah, 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 ah. Oh, this, this is good here. This is actually brilliant. 
because it's not undoable. This really does. Like, these parts right here, it makes you fucking clench your ass cheeks. If you can play this game and do this part here without fucking clenching or stressing out or your muscles in your body tightening is what I mean by ass cheeks tightening. If you can do this part right here with this balloon and move up and down and not, it's such a tight fit. If you can do this without some part of your body tensing up, like, you got me beat. I mean, I'm a, I've been a gamer my entire fucking life. But that part right there was um, pretty fucking stressful. And so what is this? Is this does this mean like the walls are going to move in here? Like I got to keep going or the wall is going to close in? Is that what that means? I don't know. Yes, it, it, no, I don't think that's what that means. Maybe it just means I got to move back and forth to keep from killing myself. Like, right and down, right and down. I don't know. I have no idea, guys. You guys tell me what this fucking writing means, because I can't read most of it. I've never been good at fucking reading caveman glyphics. Alright, I think that's telling me I'm going to drop the basket somewhere, but not here, obviously. Oh, God! Oh, God, now I got something chasing me? Oh, hell no. Oh, hell no. So much for the, uh... Oh, God, no! No! Bitch! No! Fuck! God damn it! I gotta do it again. Well, at least I started down here. Alright. So we're just gonna keep moving here. We know the thing's coming. See if we can get a little more of a distance there. Good start. And we're gonna cut this corner a little bit closer this time. Fuck you! Oh my god! No! No, bitch! Oh, whew. Die! There we go. This shit killed it. Cool. The light killed it. See? Light kills evil. Light conquers all. Oh, so this is obviously where we leave this thing. Alright, we're gonna put you down, little buddy. Carefully. Carefully. Got it. Aww, oh, it was a fucking tree. A glowy white tree. See? See, guys, this game does reward you. Oh god, no. Nope, 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 nope. Alright. Getting harder. What? We're back in these fucking tunnels again now. Alright. Oh shit. Getting tight again. Okay, so the tail can touch. It's just a balloon. You can drag the tail if you want. Green. I want to want to make sure the balloon is cool. God. At least nothing's chasing me right now. Knock on wood. Alright. Kind of a cool game. I mean, to be honest, I could make a game like this, I think, pretty easy. So this is pretty... I mean, I don't think this game would be... It'd be actually fun crafting these levels, I think. Um... Yeah, I was expecting these needles to move, but no, they're not. They're just scary looking. Okay, we got this. Then I'm going to have a jump scare that will pop out at me. One of these fucking arrows will bring itself at me or something. No? Okay. That would actually probably make me shit my pants. One of these arrows just sprung out or dropped. What the fuck was that? Something popped up there. Oh, it was a drop of water exploding. Okay. I wonder if that drop of water fucks me up. I bet it does. I bet you that drop of water will fuck you up. I got lucky there, if that's the case. Pass. Where will I go? I will go up. I will take the... What is that? Take the... Hmm. It looks like I need maggots to open that door, so I'm guessing I'm going down. I need my maggots. Are my maggots over here? God. Height. Caverns here. Um. No reason to come over here, is there? Anything over here? Oh, we just had that in. I just wanted to make sure while I was already halfway there that Maggie didn't pop 
up or something if I went over there to the end. I know you guys are watching me laughing at me going, oh my god. Alright. Um so stressful. Yeah, I think that I'm gonna go up here. And I'm gonna go north here, I think. That gives me a little more room. And I'm gonna go here. Yeah. Because that's a dead end, so I did take the right path there. The bad thing about this game is there's not going to be any replayability or replay value here. Like, after you beat this, why would you ever play it again, right? So I don't know how much content is here. So far, I'm enjoying it. Oh, God. This is just too... You gotta be good. Alright. Get save point in case I fucking die. There's my maggots. Oh god! Fuck! Son of a bitch! No! Oh my god, now I gotta do all this again. And it gets you... Frustrates you, so you start moving faster, and then you're... Kill yourself again, trying to get back to where you was. Like all these games. But I guess you do get better and faster at it the more you do it, right? Because I know I'm, like, doing this twice as fast as I did last time. All right. Right here, I need to be... Oh. All right. So we got to get moving so we can hide in one of these little... All right. Uh, oh, God, that was so close. Phew. Oh, fuck you. Bitch. Got our maggots. There better not be another rock that falls. There's another one. Ooh, this game is getting stressful as fuck, man. I actually like it. I really like this game. The only thing I don't like is the no replay value. Hmm. But first time you're gonna have fun. Some of you guys will probably curse like a mofo. Not me. I would never curse at a game like this. Not would never happen. Nope, nope, nope. Oh god, oh god. My maggots. All right. All right. Well, you guys are enjoying the content. If you are, make sure you hit the like button, guys. I would appreciate that. And um. Oh. Motherfucker. At least it's saved. Okay. Oh no. What? What? It didn't save? Don't get the maggots again? Oh, remember what I was just saying about, like, I sent a game? Yeah, I feel like it really should have saved. I thought it was saving every time I opened a door. Yeah, this is some... This is some bullshit. This is some total bullshit here. This, this developer's just fucking laughing his ass off at me. I know he is. He's gonna watch this video right here, and he's gonna fucking laugh his ass off. He's gonna go, oh, gotcha. I got you. I'll support you, Zaxter. Oh, you thought it was gonna save there, but it didn't. Now you gotta go get the maggots again. I can't believe you're calling my game maggots. Alright. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Ah. <sighs> Yeah, this game is entertaining, you guys. If you guys think this is fun to watch, definitely let me know. Give me a comment. Come on. I know there's another rock. I saw two rocks drop last time. Check over here. No? Better not fucking spit a rock at me. Okay. Oh, God. You gotta get to the left, because I know a rock's gonna drop. Yep. Okay, so we gotta be more careful here, because I don't want to have to go get my maggots again. This is annoying. Nope, nope, nope. Why does it feel like I'm bigger with the maggots on me? Uh, Alright, I know I'm not, but... Okay. Alright. Alright. Do not save game? 
Okay, I'm waiting. 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 Come on. Come on. Are you good? Are we good? No? Oh shit. Okay, you guys done pooping? You guys done pooping? No, nope, not yet. Oh god. Okay, are we done pooping yet? Son of a bitch. Oh, the rocks are fading, so it's never gonna be done pooping. Oh my god. No! No! Ah! Oh, my god! <laughs> I almost shit myself right there. Oh my god, that was so close. Alright, it better save here. You better fucking save, game. Alright, so now we're in the rain. Looks like a mouth with, like, teeth. Got a dragon's mouth. Anybody see that? Right here? Because the eye could be, like, up here. Alright. I know, you guys think I'm weird. Where am I going, game? Let me guess, lightning is gonna strike. Yep! I thought, I thought it was going to be a lightning bolt, though, that I would have to dodge, kind of like the rocks. Alright, where are we going? So we're going back down into the... Ooh, there's a... Fuck. Um, why do I have a feeling that the black clouds are going to kill me here? Am I missing something? I wonder if lightning, like, strikes these metal rods here. Hmm. I'm just wondering if there's anything I need to get to keep to make the uh, dark clouds white. All right, I guess we'll try to go into the dark clouds, and then it'll fucking kill me, and the developer can go, ha 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 ha, Zach, ha ha, you're looking idiot, ha ha ha. All right. No, nope, we're going for it. No, it didn't kill me. Okay. What are we doing now? Hello? Um... Face does nothing. I don't understand. Uh... Hello? What am I doing? So confused. Okay, so what happens if we... I guess we'll just try touching one of these fucking... Oh, that didn't work. Hmm. We're just trying to figure out if there's any fucking clues here. Is there anything that I'm not getting that I need to get before I go in there, I wonder? The only other thing I can think of here. Or maybe you're not supposed to go in there. Maybe that's just a dead end. Okay. Can't go any higher here. Okay. Oh, there's a white tree. Okay. Aha. Alright. What are we doing here, though? Hello? Face doesn't do anything. Okay, we're kind of onto something though, but what do we do with the white tree? Can't go any higher there. Hmm. Interesting game. I do like this game. Oh, now we have a little thing over there. Okay. I didn't see that little red thing before. Pretty sure that wasn't there before. Oh, it's it's a it's gonna blow it up, right? Oh, okay. So we touched the white key, and then that left whatever it was. See, I told you that. Uh, oh, goddamn it! See, I told you I didn't think the uh, dark clouds were good. I was right on thinking that. All right. Oh, we figured it out, guys. Alright. Oh, God, 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 no, no, no. No! Damn it.
Yeah, we are not gonna try both at once here. Okay, so we're gonna have to go... We could go on the bottom here. I'm just trying to figure this out, guys. Um, I think we might try to go through here and go down and around this way. Yeah. Yeah, let's try a different route this time. Yeah, let's go down this way. Oh, God. Oh, wow. Um... Yeah, let's go right here. I don't know why. Oh, there's something up there. We need. No timer, so I'm going to take my time here. Oh, okay. Got a tooth now. And anytime you're doing this, you get bigger, so basically it gets harder when you get something like this. Oh! Oh, I thought it was dead there. I honestly thought I was fucking dead there. Some of these... Some of these things are so close. Like, I feel like I'm surviving by... Less than millimeters. Okay, we're definitely going down this way now. Let's see what's down here. God, look at all these fucking blades. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yikes. It was getting very, very stressful. Gonna stop here. We're gonna go down a little bit. Jesus. Yeah, you gotta be patient as fuck here. I'm not trying to get too greedy here. I feel like this is a point where if I fucked up here and died, you guys watching would scream. Like, oh my god, you fucking moron. What? I came all the way over here for nothing? What? Surely not. Surely there's some reason for coming over here, right? But What? Nothing here? Oh my god, I came all the way over here for nothing. Lame. I'm almost tempted to just kill myself so I can just go get the part and then go up. But we'll just we'll just keep going like this. A little trigger, this is another point where the developer is like, ha 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 ha, just fucking rolling on the floor laughing. I got you, Zaxxer99, you think you're so smart. Alright. I do want to go and thank the developer for offering me a free evaluation key to this game, by the way. I don't think I mentioned that yet. A cool game. Ooh, that's so close. Alright, one more, right? We got this. We went all the way over there for fucking nothing, guys. Now we gotta come up here and get past these blades with this fucking thing? This is some bullshit. Alright, I'm scared. Oh my god. Oh god, no! Come on! <laughs> oh my god. This game. Alright. Alright. Uh, I feel like I cut that about as close as I could. I feel like we're going to have to go back down to that area where we went down there and there was nothing down there. I feel like once we do something else, we're going to have to go back down there to get our maggots or something. All right. 
I don't think we're going through the middle. I think we're, I think I had the right idea here. Come on, 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 Okay, it's got to be up the other way. The definition of insanity is doing the same thing over and over again and expecting a different result. So I feel like it's going to be right here. We're going to have to go in between the two blades and we're going to have to time this like fucking perfectly. All right. There we go. Now are we going to the left? Are we going up? Damn game. So many different paths. Uh, this is too tedious to uh, do over and over and over again because you're taking the wrong path. And... Oh yeah, we already went over here. That's right. Well, while we're here, let's make sure we're not laying this down over the... Because we had something like this before, remember, and we laid it down on top of a a flat area, and there is a flat area right here. Well, we had a basket. It wasn't a tooth like this. Let me guess, it's going to kill us? Yeah. Yep. Nope. Well, I wanted to try it to make sure that wasn't the thing to do. Okay, so we basically got to go up. All right. Got to find out the secret to this game. Method of the Madness here. Pretty cool game. I think a lot of people are going to get too annoyed, especially this part right here. Um, this is probably going to be the spot where a lot of people just rage quit. It makes me wonder how much harder this game's going to get. Well, at least we know what we got to do here now. Just gotta time it. Like, we, we wanna get right. Uh, okay. There we go. Oh god. Okay. Oh god. Oh god, really? What the hell? Oh my god, this is so stressful. What in the hell? Come on! Oh my god, this game's annoying. This is insane. Alright, now I don't want to move. Alright, we want to move left a little bit and then go up again. Oh, phew. oh god. Ooh. Oh. oh my god, this is tight. I'm having to catch my breath between each one of these. Boink. Go. Oh wow. Okay, there's only one here. I can't overlook this one though. Ooh, damn it! I just fucking knew and I felt that that last one that looked so easy was going to get me. Like, ah, uh, one more time. One more time. So the game does have an addicting quality to it here, guys. Because if you make a little bit of progress, you it seems like you want to try it one more time. So it does have that addicted, you know, that aspect to it. That as long as you're making progress, you know, after X amount of tries or whatever... You do, you can see the light at the end of the tunnel and you want to play again. So for that, I like it. I just wonder how 
how much more there is to this game because I can't imagine this game getting much tougher than this. So part of me is wonder if, wondering if this is almost over. I don't know. Oh god. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh, that was fucking close. Alright. Oh my god. Okay. Oh, we got it. We got it. We got it. Okay, what's up here now? Alright. Come on, settle down. What is this about? Oh! Okay, I thought, at first I thought I died. I was like, what the fuck? Okay. God damn it, man! Oh, at least if, if I had to do it all over again, I was probably going to quit right there. Okay. So now we got to get the black part to get the... Yeah, we got to get a black thing over here. So we got to go pick up a black thing somewhere. I'm guessing it's over here. I'm I'm thankful that he put a save point right there. Because, yeah, I would have seriously rage quit right there. What is this guy about? Yo, bro. What up? Um, guessing I can't touch you? Yeah. Wanted to check. Okay, so now we're going down and we're... You know where we went to that one empty cavern? I bet you there's a black part there now. So we gotta do this part again. But this should be easier because it's just us, the balloon. But let's not get too big of a hurry here. Yeah, it's way easier when you're not carrying something. Let's see if that other black part's over here now. The black part to the peace symbol. No? Nothing over here, huh? Okay, well where's the other one at then? Hmm. Yeah, I thought it would have been there. Well damn. Coming back through here, right? Ah! Whew, that was close. Um, is it gonna be back over here? To the right again? No, it's gonna be over here, right? Yeah, there it is. Glad I looked. And again, see what I'm saying? We made it a little bit further, so we're continuing the game. Fun little game. Alright. I think making a game like this would take so much time to balance it all out and make it sure it's really challenging, not too easy, but not too hard. So, well done to the developer. Absolutely. Alright, now we got to be more careful. But we've done all this before here. So this isn't nothing we haven't done yet. Because we was over here with the white one, I think. Yeah, we were. When I was looking for the right place to go, I was everywhere. Ooh. Careful.
Okay, don't get in too big of a hurry, dummy. Breathe. We've done all this before. Ooh, ooh, that was close. Okay. There are a lot of fucking close calls in this game, I'm just saying. Oh, come on! Arg! And I have to go all the way from here again. Oh my god. That is so annoying. Like, I guess that makes up for all the times that I barely made it by a freaking millimeter. I got killed by a millimeter that time. Yeah, that was frustrating. Alright. Odd. Okay. Let's be careful here, because this is where we died last time. Breathe again. Up just a little bit. Well, that's so close. I'm wondering if you'd move slower or anything like that with this black one this time, just to change things up a little bit, you know? Probably not, but... Oh, God. Okay. Fuck! Me! <laughs> Alright. Okay, we made it. Woo. No, what? No. Oh my god. What now? What now? What are we doing now? <laughs> it reminds me of the VDS that I put in a, a rock, a molten rock. It reminds me so much of the VDS that I added to Rock and Roll, my first game on Steam for some reason. Probably just the shape of it. What are we getting now? There's still something in that one cave that I went to that was empty. Where I was trying to set down the... the white... part. Over here. So I'm guessing we're going over here this time. I'm hoping because I don't want to go down again. There's nothing over here. Oh, there, yeah, there we go. Okay. So this is what we need to open the... We're getting our maggots, right? Oh no, we got another thing to carry. Son of a bitch. Maggots would have been easier. Maggots on my balloon. Oh my god. And this one's swinging. Oh my god. So at least the other two parts weren't swinging back and forth. This one's swinging right and left. So it's going to be even harder to get up there. OMG. 
See how when I'm just staying still, it's swinging left and right? It's gonna make this so much harder. Part of it. Oh, God. Uh, talk about close. Ooh. One more, one more, baby. Let's move to the right just a little bit. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes! I made it the first time that time. Yay me. Woo! Alright, do I take this over this thing as well? I do. Oh no! I gotta get another one now. I gotta get a black one. What? What? Come on. No! Where am I going now? The only other way is over here to the left. Right? This big blob thing is. There it is. Okay, so it's going to chase us as soon as we get it. Oh, this is so fun. Yep. Oh, God. Oh, God. No. No, Mommy. Ah! Ah! No! Oh, I need to go down there. Oh, okay, good. I thought I was going to have to go down to escape it. We got it. So now I put this one right here. And we open the door. That has to be the last level, right? Because I don't think I can take any more of this. What? What? Where am I? I'm over here now. We got sound effects, though. Remember how I was talking about how I wanted sound effects? This makes me think this is the last level. And I'm having so much fun, I don't want to quit now. This game really is cool. Alright. Oh my god. As long as I don't have to carry anything else, I'm fine. I'm happy. We can get through this, right guys? Okay, we're just gonna go... Ooh, that's close. Here, we're gonna try to go two. Like right here. Ah, ah. I tried to get greedy. Son of a bitch. Alright. Because I didn't know if, it was gonna, if I was gonna be able to make that. Alright, so we got this, we got this, we got this, we got this, we got this. Get close, and then go up. Okay. Alright, let's try this again. Right here? Okay. Yeah, we're just gonna go the two this time. Oh my god, is that close! That isn't even a millimeter, guys. Oh, that was insane. Alright. I can tell by the music this is almost over, right, guys? Right, right, right? Such a cool game. I really like this. Alright. Um. What's the big deal here? There's no big deal there. Okay. What are we doing here? Oh, I see. This is... This is yikes here. We're gonna have to time this so perfectly. And be at the, exactly the right spot, too. Okay, so... The outside is going slower than... The inside, right? So we want to stay on the outside here. I feel like. Get a little closer. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Made it. Alright. And there's no save point, so we need to be really careful here. This has to be the last little oomph of this game. The last little challenge. I mean, we already got the peace symbol. It'd be really nice if it saved somewhere here, but I don't think it does. I bet it doesn't. we got here 
No problem. Just taking it slow, guys. i to make sure I don't fuck this up. Well, I mean, I probably will, but... I don't want me to fuck up by rushing this. So I'm not gonna get greedy here and try to go for two at once. Unless I have to. You know, because some other blades after me or something. I know you guys are out there, just have some balls, Axer. Go for it. Yeah, but then I kill myself and you guys are like, what an idiot. Why didn't you just take it slow? Somebody else would say. Oh god. Oh god. Start getting overconfident, man. Alright. Yeah, I wish it saved right here would be really nice. Okay, so we obviously have to... We can't go down below that. We have to go up here. Alright. Go. 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 Get up here. Okay, let's take a stop. Let's take a stop. Take a breather. Whew. You're stressing me the hell out. Ooh. Oh my god. Okay. I'm so stressed right now. I'm like more stressed now than I ever was for any test in high school. I'm just saying. I can hear my parents yelling at me. Why would you be more concerned about a stupid game than high school, Zaxter? This is why you're working jobs you're working at now rather than making the six figures. Shut up, Mom. Dad. Go, 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 go. Okay. Alright, what do we got over here? Oh, God. See, we have to do two at a time here. Okay, we're going to stay down low so we have more time. Okay, we're going to right over the slit. There we go. Okay. We're taking it easy. Not gonna get greedy here. Alright, because I feel like we're so close. Oh, this game is really trying to stress me the fuck out. So close. We're good, I think. Well, I would have been mad if that would have killed me. I would have been so fucking mad. Alright, breathe. Breathe. Oh, look at that, guys. We're so close here. We're so close. If this is not the end, at least it'll save here. Alright, we got that part. Not the end yet. Where are we now? Four pass? Okay, let's check out over here first. We got another dark. Yeah, we got darkness over there. Hmm. Okay. Oh, man, I keep thinking we're at the end and we're not. Oh, okay. What are we doing here? Hello? Oh, yikes. We could have died there. Hello, tree. Got another dark thing there. It looks like a gate, maybe. Got... What? Hmm. Oh, okay. Weird. A white fluffy cloud up here, so that's where I'm going. I have no idea. Oh, look at that, how that's mirrored. That's interesting. So I feel like we're not collecting that balloon. 
feel like we are trying to... Oh, this is so cool. I feel like we're doing this. Yeah. I could be wrong, but I feel like this is what we're trying to do. What? No. Are you serious right now? Yeah, there's our cloud right there. Okay. Oh what? What? I thought we were com I thought we were going together there. Okay. All right. We got this. We got this. Uh, almost fucked up there. We want to wait for the right one. Okay, so what are we doing here? I don't understand. I do not understand this, guys. Um, what are we doing here? I don't understand it. Oh, what? We can't go down here, right? No. What am I missing? Damn, this is a good game. Do we want the the white balloon to get hit by the water? Is that what we want? Surely not, right? I know we don't want to get hit by the water. Oh, yep. Oh, son of a bitch. Okay. Okay, we got it now. We got it figured out. We know what we're doing. So we got to weigh the balloon down with water. And then we got to get up through there. I see. This is such a clever game. We made it, boys. Now what, though? For now. Oh, God. What the fuck? What the fuck is all this noise? God. Now, this is so random. Oh, we got to freedom. There it is. Right? I'm off the screen. Can I move down? Where am I? I'm going to keep hitting up then. Uh, okay. Hello, game. I feel like this is right at the end. What the hell? I'm trying to move my balloon back down. Um... Hello? Yeah, I thought I thought it was going to play like the end music there. I feel like we died like right at the end or the game crashed or something right here at the end. What? What? Um Hello game? I'm continuing to hold up now, but Hmm. That's really odd. Yeah, I don't see anywhere where we would have taken our balloon here at the end. Like, maybe I should have went to the right and it would have scrolled to the right here. That's the only thing I can think of here. 
Okay, let me hold down forever. Just a down and down and down and down and down and down. But I think we floated off the screen and I don't think it's going to let me come back onto it. Yeah, I feel like this is a little bit buggy here. It shouldn't let you go off the top of the screen if that's not something you can do. Or, you know, it should kill you or whatever. But to just freeze like this and not let you come back on the screen and just sit here and be like going on infinitely forever without beating the game or whatever. Yeah, this this needs to be fixed here. So the game's not perfect because it shouldn't let this happen. Yeah. So that's really unfortunate. We sat there and played this game for like an hour and yeah, look at this. Like, what a way to end the game. And I feel like we were right at the end too. I mean, I could be wrong because I thought we were right at the end like 15 minutes ago, but what the hell? Dev, the dev of this game, what's going on? Like, did I win? I feel like I won, but um, fuck, man. I can't. The escape key does nothing. Base bar does nothing. All right, we're going to close the game here, guys. We're going to relaunch it, and hopefully it lets me load up, like, that last part. Load game. We'll see if we can actually win it here now. Okay, so we can do this part. We know what to do here. That's fine. Yeah, I feel like that, that last part's broken there. It needs, to, it, needs a, it needs an update. That should never happen. It should never just, like, infinitely do nothing. Like I said, if you're not allowed to move off the top of the screen, then it should just kill you or something. If that's not what you're supposed to do. Okay. So here, we're just going to go a bit closer there. Now we can go right here. Oh, it popped it. There we go. I didn't even have last time. I feel like I was really lucky to get through this last time. Okay, we're good. Oh, game is so stressful. Okay, so now we got to dodge all these purple things again. Which, I feel like it wasn't that hard the first time, but... Alright. Let's go this way. I might have to take the exact same timing and route that I did last time. Not sure. Uh, here now. Okay, let's go around these guys. There we go. I almost hit the side. Okay, so we hear like, see the stars come in, and this is where I thought I won. So I guess I'm going over here to the right. Yep, it scrolls to the right. So the game let me go up and off the screen, and then it just went into an infinite loop, and it wouldn't let me come back down. So, yeah, all you need to do to the developer is just prevent the player from going up off the edge of the screen there. And then your game will be amazing. The end. Yep, I knew we were right at the end. Yep. I knew that part right there where we saw the stars because it looked like we escaped and we were out of space. Oh, so. Echo and Indie Tail, guys. two ninety nine for this. I feel like I feel like this developer deserves, you know, some some recognition and some sales uh, for people that like this kind of game, because I can guarantee you he went to a lot, he put a lot of effort into this. This isn't just like a low effort asset flip that we see so often for, you know, the $1.99, 99 cent, and two ninety nine price range. This developer actually tried to make a fun game. He made it very, very interesting and uh, stressful at times. Uh, but not so stressful that it doesn't keep you playing. As you saw, I just kept playing and playing and playing until I finally beat the game because it did have that much of an addictive quality. And I feel like the time to beat this game is about right. I feel like if you would have made it like it much longer, players probably would have got bored with it or, you know, it just would have been too much. So I feel like this, the length of the game is about right. And two ninety nine is a good price uh, for the game. Uh, because it is fun to play and it is addicting and it will make you, you know, cleanse your butt cheeks together uh, a few times. I can almost guarantee you that. So I really like this game. Richard Borges, thanks so much for making this game. Now, usually I look for about a dollar uh, per hour on, uh, you know, a good value for a game to give a game a really good score. 
this game doesn't really once you beat this game you know it's not going to be different the next time there's no really no there's really no replay value here uh so basically we're looking at about three dollars for an hour but this game is interesting enough and fun enough and unique enough to where i feel that it's worth the extra price so echo and indie tail guys is going to get a high score from me i like this game i'm going to give this game an 8.5 out of 10 after playing it all the way through i really like it i think for three dollars you can't go wrong so be sure you let, you let me know down the, so be sure you let me know down in the comments below if this video has inspired you to go out and try echo and indie tail and buy it yourself i would love to know or let me know what you guys would get the game from watching my video did you not buy it? Put it down in the comments below. I'd love to see you guys. Thanks so much for watching. This is Ben Zach 99 And I just got to say, it's so refreshing to have, you know, a decent game after all the missed videos that I've played the last week or so. So thanks so much, Richard Borges, for not making yet another piece of garbage on Steam at this price range. Love to see it. And I love, you know, I look very forward to seeing what kind of game you're going to make next. So thanks a lot. Thanks for watching, everybody. We'll see you in the next video. Take care of each other. Love you guys. Love you guys all. Peace.